You're bleeding. Yeah, I know. What the hell, man? It appears to be a minor injury. Wait, these illusions are just illusions, right? I think I cracked a tooth. Well, the illusions should be harmless. Unless someone's doing something they shouldn't be doing. Right, Cole? Uh, don't look at me like that. This was not my fault. Well then. This is quite the mystery. Was Cole hurt in an accident? Or did Beck do it on purpose because he was salty about having to use the name Mysterio? Again? Let's see what she had to say. Hello, Spider-Man. Um, I just wanted to let you know that Quentin has agreed to enter some court-monitored counseling to help him with his post-prison transition. Finally. Cole, please be respectful. He's been through a lot. Sorry. I'm just... I'm just glad he's getting held. No. Anyway, Quentin asked me to pass this along. He thinks he's close to figuring out what's going on. So just keep up the good work, Spider-Man. Good on Beck for going into counseling. We all need help sometimes. You have everything to fear. Defeat all enemies. Okay. Is that Spider Man? Help! Help! Don't worry, I'll find you. Destroy them all. Make Mysterio get it on my nerves. I wonder if this is how Beck acted back in the day. I may be the Skepticism will save you. Okay, mystery person. Keep that in mind.
Well, the nightmare is over. You're safe now. Quentin, we have to talk. You seem to want to talk a lot. But what is it that you actually do as part of this endeavor? <clears throat> Cole discovered some hidden routines in the Mysterium code. We can scan bank cards in our customers' pockets? A 21st century parlor trick. We use that information to look at their purchase history, browsing history, create a bespoke world that makes our audience believe in the unbelievable. But if it gets out that we have people's bank information... I'm the only one with the encryption codes. And I haven't told anyone. What about you? No, of course not. Then as long as you and Cole keep it to yourselves, our secret is safe. Right? Right. Beck was scanning people's credit cards to customize his illusions? Sounds like something the old Mysterio would do. Come on! Let me change you forever! Let the agony begin! I don't know where I am! Sit tight. I'll find you. My illusions will never die. But you. Crazy. Someone's got to be messing with these Mysteriums. Based on that last call from Betsy, seems like Beck and his crew have it almost figured out. He's not listening. He has his tricks, you know. No, we're safe. Oh, he's acting very weird. You mean weirder. He's gone quiet all of a sudden. Won't speak to me. Do we have a way out in case he gets violent or something? We'll be fine. Here he comes. Let's talk more later. Sounds like Cole and Betsy were scared of Beck's change in behavior. Another call from Betsy. Spider-Man, Cole and I are a bit concerned. He said he was gonna kill us. Please, Cole, don't panic. <sighs> Spider-Man, we found out Quentin lied to us. Instead of going to counseling, he went somewhere else. When we confronted him, he said some threatening things and then left. Hopefully he just needs to cool off, but if you see him or hear from him, can you let us know? Thank you. Uh. This just went from bad to worse. Mm. Got a new voicemail. Spider-Man, we need to meet. Come to Coney Island. I have an urgent matter to discuss with you. Well, well that doesn't sound like a trap at all. Just hope he hasn't hurt Betsy and Cole.
Okay, where's Beck? Welcome, Spider-Man. If you're looking for Betsy and Cole, they are no longer with us. You killed them? Don't act surprised. You've known from the beginning who you're dealing with. What the... to defeat him. Wait. If you're here, Mysterio's out there. How is that happening? Oh! <laughs> Enough of this! I'll end you myself! You actually think you can defeat me? This is insulting! I control everything! I am a god! Your reality is what I deem it to be! No! It's over. So, you managed to survive. Doesn't it matter? Alive or dead, you will never escape me. Nice try. Clever Spider-Man. You cannot win. I am infinite. 
When you are dead, the city will finally give me the respect. Yeah. You want respect? Then stop all this! Power surge? Surprise? Maybe it's time for you to put some respect on my name. Time to get out of here. Guess I gotta get through that wall. The sim is down. Get it back! I'm trying! It was Quentin. He made us do this. Where is he? Help. They're here. I still have a lot of questions. This... Should clear things up. So can I tell everyone Mysterio's a good guy now? <laughs> Mysterio will always be a villain. Just as Spider-Man will always be a hero. It's when you start looking at the people behind the masks that things get messy. he's on to us if so there's only one solution we need him alive what do we do just tie him up or something yes good idea we set him up as the fall guy in case anyone catches on yeah like tell everyone he went full mysterio exactly he would be the one most likely to steal money not the two women who aren't former supervillains now we just need to figure out how to get the richest people in the city into these mysteriums okay but there's still some code that I haven't figured out, and the Spider-Men will help us with that. Ha! <laughs> That's brilliant. Heroes always looking to help. And if all goes to plan, we'll have millions in the bank before anyone catches on. And when they do, Quentin goes back to prison, and we retire in style. Looks like the biggest illusion was Betsy and Cole's innocence. Wonder where Beck is going from here.